Deep under the ocean, energy is produced endlessly. Pushed by such energy, complex plate tectonics continue on the lithosphere. After violent plate collision, Taiwan Island with towering mountain ridges and complex geological structures was formed. The interaction of climate change, natural processes, and continuous plate tectonics form different types of unique landscapes on the island. Diverse types of habitat gave rise to biodiversity. To preserve, conserve, and reasonably use these geological landscapes, the Forestry Bureau has announced 21 nature reserves in respect of the Cultural Heritage Preservation Act and launched a nationwide landscape census. By 2012, 341 geosites for conservation purposes were registered. The Forestry Bureau also began setting up Taiwan Geopark demo sites in 2010 and has formed the Taiwan Geopark Network with six geoparks, hoping to continuously increase the momentum for landscape conservation, environmental education, landscape tourism, and community development, the four core values of geoparks. In 1997, UNESCO introduced the concept of geoparks. The organization describes geopark as an area encompassing sites of special geological significance, rare natural attributes, and cultural value. These geo-heritage sites provide a classroom where visitors can learn about the history of the land. In addition, Geoparks can boost local tourism. Not only do they educate tourists and popularize geological science, they also provide a new source of income for the local people. More importantly, as geoparks are conserved and visited, they meet the needs of the local people. What mount volcanoes are made of? We don't know. Don't know, right? Mount volcanoes are made by surface cracks, underground liquids, natural gases, and slurry. What you see right now is called a mud cone. With community involvement and through rediscovering environmental landscapes and transforming environmental knowledge. Geoparks allow more visitors to recognize the beauty of landscapes, promote landscape tourism development, and boost community economic development. Geoparks also allow people to see the changes of landscapes and tectonics movement, and rethink relations between man and nature. Taoling has many beautiful natural landscapes. I hope that through drawing, visitors can see the wonders of this place during their brief stay in Taoling. Rediscovering landscapes allows us to rethink the harmony between man and nature and the ancient wisdom of coexistence. When we were little, every now and then we'd come help the adults fix the dam. We'd find rocks and they'd pile them up. Back then, the adults did all the heavy work. It was really tiring, but we got used to it. Now, we don't find it tiring. Landscape conservation is much about preserving valuable natural landscapes, but more about the way we should live. Human beings are always the biggest beneficiary. This is the story of geoparks. They are the latest status of landscape conservation and the best spots to explore the beauty of Taiwan.